El Torn Barcelona, the international hub of ceramics for ceramicists, to learn, work, create, and connect, hosted a two-week symposium that brought together a group of world-renowned ceramicists to create a joint project, a mural, to be installed at Angela Coles, the most important ceramic supply center in Catalonia. The symposium was held in conjunction with the 47th Congress of the International Academy of Ceramics, IAC, with the theme of ceramics in architecture and public space. Wasting no time, the artists jumped right into planning the layout of the mural. They did this by creating a space on the floor and putting cardboard squares on it to represent each tile. After lots of agreeing and disagreeing, the artists came up with a general layout of the tiles and quickly moved on to preparing the actual clay tiles. While working, the group came up with a name for the project, Diagonal 11, representing 11 artists working on a common work of art together in Barcelona. The size of the tiles and the three tiles that the artist needed to work on was fixed, but creative freedom and expression were left up to each artist. Once the construction of the tiles was finished, they were carefully set to dry. During the process, the artists had an opportunity to talk about their inspiration and how they feel about coming together to work at El Torn for this symposium. I am very uh, dispersed in what I do. If I have an exhibition, people think it's a group show because it's not one thing. Right now I'm making books, I'm making boxes. And uh, I like to do large scale projects built out of smaller uh, pieces using my technique. I describe my work as abstract organic forms. They're based on the natural world. They're inspired by the natural world. But I do fire my work but at very low temperatures and I experiment with different methods of firing that way. El barro para mí es el blog de notas donde yo eh, dibujo mis, mis sentimientos. Eh, yo soy una persona que quizás eh, expresarme eh, verbalmente eh, me es complicado. Entonces a través del barro lo utilizo como, como medio de comunicación hacia los demás. You know, for me clay is, is, is so alive and can imp take imprints of, of everything we want to imprint there. So, for me, clay is just uh, magic. I have to work with different people coming from different countries. It's always challenging. Eh, aparte de conocer eh, grandes ceramistas de otros países, eh, también conoces la persona en sí y sus culturas. I appreciate the um, camaraderie and the, um, uh, the sharing that's going on working with uh, different people on new things that we've never made before and working on other people's things as well. So. I think one, uh, one gets inspired by looking at, at the ways of working of other people and it somehow flows over from one to the other and you, you start sort of experimenting. absolutely awesome. It's an amazing experience. The process is wonderful. It's very exciting. It's great. Yeah. There was also time for the artists to work on personal projects, exchanging experience and working together with other artists, taking advantage of all the infrastructure El Torn has to offer. A few of the resident artists at El Torn gave short presentations of their work, and Corey Bain, a resident artist and teacher at El Torn, gave a workshop on fascinating Korean stamp-making techniques. Once the tiles were dried, they were loaded into the kiln for the first firing. After firing, the tiles were returned to the floor to make sure that the layout and the concept worked out as planned. Arranging the tiles confirmed that the individual styles combined well in an overall layout. A group decision was made on glazing colors, and glazing each tile was done by spraying. The kiln was loaded again for the second firing. Although the mural was the primary objective of the symposium, there was time for some sightseeing around Barcelona, having meals together, and just enjoying each other's company. Another important aspect of the symposium was the artists sharing some of their techniques they have become famous for. This was done in short, intense master classes at El Torn Barcelona. 
On the final day of the symposium, the group of artists loaded up a bus with all of the tiles and headed to Angela Cole's factory to install the tiles on the wall that had been constructed especially for this purpose. Once there, artists took turns working on the mural while others experimented and shared their knowledge of special firing techniques of ovara and milk firing. Before heading back to Barcelona, the group took a tour of Angela Cole's factory to see the process of making clay. The symposium was a great success, culminating in a mural called Diagonal 11, representing a contemporary contribution to the ceramics and public space. Created by 11 artists, executed at El Torn, Barcelona, and installed at Ceramics Colette in Espereguera.